If that's all we have, that's all we have. But, but the test requires 700. We ran the test exactly as Chief Engineer Fermin approved. We don't know what it is. It's fine. Are we supposed to do those or not? Uh, I haven't reviewed. We only just found out we're... There, review it. Switch, switch the turbine off while the reactor's still running. This is not good. Shut the fuck up! Unit shift chief Akimov and engineer Topdanov encountered technical difficulties leading to an accumulation of hydrogen in the control system tank. Uh, I think if we turn off LAC, it may be possible to get more control. Do it, go. Right, switch off local automatic control. Go to global. Hang on, need. LAC disabled, global control activated. What did you do? LAC disabled, global control oh, activated. I don't understand. LAC disabled, global control activated. It regrettably ignited, damaging the plants, setting the roof on fire. Tank is quite large. It's the only logical explanation. Of course, uh, Deputy Chief Engineer Dyatlov was directly supervising the test, so he would know best. We're taking measures to ensure a steady flow of water through the core. What about radiation? Obviously, down here is nothing but in the reactor building, I've been told. 3.6 Rungan per hour. But that's as high as the meter. 3.6. Well, that's not great, but it's not horrifying. Not at all. Not great, not terrible. From the feed water, I assume. Mm hmm. Not great, not terrible. What does the decimeter say? Uh, 3.6 Rungan, but that's as high as the meter. 3.6. Not great, not terrible. Well? Well, <clears throat> well, I sent my dosimetrist into the reactor building. The large dosimeter from the safe, the one with the thousand Rungan capacity. What was the number? Well, there was none. The meter burned out the second it was turned on. Well, it's typical. See, this is what Moscow does. Sends us shit equipment and wonders why things go wrong. We found another dosimeter. From the military fire department. Shit equipment. It only goes to 200 Ronkin, but it's better than the small ones. And? Well, it maxed out. 200 Ronkin. What game are you playing? I, I asked him. He took multiple measurements. He's my best man. I, it's another faulty meter. You're wasting our time. I checked the meter against the control. What's wrong with you? How'd you get that number from feed water leaking from a blown tank? Well, he died. Then what the fuck are you talking about? Well, I... <clears throat> I walked around the exterior of Building 4. You didn't. I think there's graphite on the ground in the rubble. You didn't. You didn't see graphite. I did. You didn't. I did. You didn't. You did! Because it's not there. What? Are you suggesting the core. what? exploded? Yes. Oh. Zinnikov, you're a nuclear engineer, so am I. So please tell me. How an RBMK reactor core explodes. Not a meltdown, an explosion. I love to know. I can't. Are you stupid? No. Then why can't you? I think. I don't see how it could explode. But it did. Enough. I'll go up to the vent block roof from there. You can look right down into reactor building four. I'll see you with my own... my own eyes. From the feed water, I assume. What? Go to the vent block roof and report back what you see. No. No, I won't do that. Of course you will.
be fine. You'll see. Come on. You'll be fine. You'll see. Come on. glowing. The Cherenkov effect, completely normal phenomenon, can happen with minimal radiation. I wonder how many of you know the name of this place. I wonder how many of you know the name of this place. 